Welcome to Learning Mole. This is lesson one in our series Multiplication for Kids. This little series of lessons will take you from very early stages of multiplication right through your child's multiplication journey to the end of um, primary school. Um, the lessons are designed to dip in and out of depending on your age, your ability of your child or um, if you want to watch all of them in sequence that's absolutely fine but we designed them so that they were short and sweet and that you can just get the different stages that your child would actually be working at. So very 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 early multiplication is the focus for this um, lesson. Your child will probably start thinking about multiplication around um, the year one sort of P2 level although they will be counting in steps and things just before that that um, they really start to introduce the idea of multiplication as a key concept, as an operation. And the first step really in that multiplication journey would be the idea of talking about repeated addition. Your child will have already been introduced to addition, they will be ready using addition, they'll be solving calculations. So it's a natural progression to move into multiplication from there. So we would use the step, the first concept of or the first step of multiplication as repeated addition and it's actually showing children what multiplication actually is. Again going back to basics, actually giving your child an understanding of what multiplication is. I've seen a lot of times, especially children in upper levels in the school, being able to solve a multiplication calculation, a written one, that they can solve no problem but if I actually ask them what they're doing and how they're doing it and what it actually means they have absolutely no clue. They've basically just learnt a formula by rote. That is fine in certain circumstances but you really need to understand what you're doing and you really need to understand the numbers so that's why it's important that your child do, does understand these key concepts because when it comes to applying it it becomes very difficult if they've just learned one method that they stick to and they can't move away from that. So we would talk about repeated addition first of all and it's actually giving chi a child a calculation, a multiplication and actually showing them physically what it is. So for example two times three that is showing them that that is actually two lots of three. It's three plus three. No problem at all. And children will get those lower numbers very quickly. It's when they get a bit into the upper times tables, which of course you probably wouldn't um, be looking at the seven times tables at this stage, but you definitely would be looking at the twos. So seven times two, it's again actually showing children that this is just the same as seven lots of two. It's seven twos. It's two plus two plus two plus two plus two plus two. And actually, I would physically move to show children these lots of two in cubes. So I've actually got, this is seven times two. Here you go. There's two, two. So you've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, seven lots of two. And it's really important that you do give your child that visual idea. These little cubes are perfect for making any sort of calculations. And again, I wouldn't worry so much about getting the written formula down, I would actually really worry about getting the practical and seeing that your child understands. So give them a calculation, give them a pile of cubes, actually ask them to make you a calculation. So I want to know what three times four looks like. So get them to actually build up three lots of four. So we've got one lot of four, two lots of four, three lots of four and that will actually show you that they understand and they actually have that visual of what multiplication actually is and for me that's a really key concept that needs to come before learning times tables or discussing times tables they need to know what actually multiplication is and this is a great visual using repeated addition is a great visual and a great way to actually show children what multiplication actually means.